So today is Friday. We have another a great home program workout for you today. Uh, so we're going to start our warm up off with a one minute sleeper stretch on each side. So what you're going to do is you're going to lay flat on one side here. All right. Elbow is going to be out at a 90 degree angle. Then you're going to roll yourself over. From here, what you're going to do is you're going to keep your shoulder flat on the ground. And then you're going to press down as far as you possibly can. Try to get that hand down to the ground. Once you feel that stretch right back through here, you're going to hold for one minute and then you'll flip sides. After that, we're going to go into three rounds of 10 PVC pass throughs. So if you have a PVC pipe or a broomstick, okay, you're going to shrug your shoulders up, bring that PVC pipe all the way to the back and then come forward. If you don't have a PVC pipe or anything like that, you can use a towel or you can use a resistance band. So do the same thing. So we we'll use the towel here, nice wide grip, shrug the shoulders up, bring that towel all the way back, and then all the way forward. Then you have 10 plank shoulder taps. So in a good push-up plank position, all right, nice tight tummy. You're gonna come over, tap your shoulder one rep, tap your shoulder two rep, and you'll do 10 reps of that. Staying in that position, you have 10 A-frame toe touches. So pushing the hips up, coming back, touching your shoulder or your toe, coming back to neutral, touching your toe and back to neutral. Then you have 10 air squats. So keep that tummy nice and tight. Arms can go up over your head, sink down as low as you can, and then stand up. And for the Metcon today, we have 10 rounds of 10 burpees. So again, remember, we're gonna drop down, touch our chest to the ground. We're gonna hop up and then give ourselves a little bit of a clap. If you can't go all the way down to the ground, you can use a target. So you can go down to a chair or a bench or what have you. Uh, then you have 10 V-ups, okay? So a V-up is gonna look like this. We're in that good hollow body position. Toes, our feet are up off the ground. Come up, meet in the middle. Now, if you can't do that, then what you're gonna do is you're gonna substitute that movement out for a knee tuck. So same thing, good hollow body position. Heels are up off the ground. Come up, give yourself a nice little hug. Now, the kicker for today is you're going to use any piece of equipment or anything that you can find up overhead. So you have 10 object overhead squats. Now, let's see how creative you can get. Try to get away from a, uh, a barbell today. So you can do a single arm dumbbell overhead squat, get the object up over your head, squat all the way down, you can do five reps on one side, five on the other. Or if you don't have any weight, what you can do is you can grab a bucket up over your head, squat down, or you can even use something like this. So anything that you can find to get up over your head you're gonna do 10 reps of it. So again, we have 10 rounds of 10 burpees, 10 V-ups, and then 10 object overhead squats. Have fun. And for our ring work today, we're gonna to accumulate five minutes of a handstand hold. Now this handstand hold can be any variation of the handstand. You can do it free floating, you can do it up against the wall. For the athletes that aren't capable of holding their body weight up just yet, you can do a pike hold. So you can put your feet up on an object, a bench, um, a bed, or anything like that. You'll put your toes up here. You're gonna walk yourself back as far as you can, and you'll hold in that position. Now, not only are you gonna accumulate that five minutes of the handstand hold, but every time that you break, you're going to do a 30 second plank. Now, you can get creative with this as well. You don't have to just stay on your elbows. You can do any kind of variation. So, we can be here, we can do a side plank. Okay, we can do an opposite um, plank hold. So one leg or one arm is down, one leg is up. I'm gonna hold here. Um, you can do any variation that you choose to, all right? So get creative with that and have fun.